1987 Constitution, Article 9, Constitutional Commissions, Letter D, Commission on Audit. Section 2. 1. The Commission on Audit shall have the power, authority, and duty to examine, audit, and settle all accounts pertaining to the revenue and receipts of and expenditures or uses of funds and property owned or held in trust by or pertaining to the government or any of its subdivisions, agencies, or instrumentalities, including government-owned or controlled corporations with original charters and on a post-audit basis. Letter A. Constitutional bodies, commissions, and offices that have been granted fiscal autonomy under this constitution. Letter B. Autonomous state colleges and universities. Letter C. Other government owned or controlled corporations and their subsidiaries and letter d such non-governmental entities receiving subsidy or equity directly or indirectly from or through the government which are required by law or the grantee institution to submit to such audit as a condition of subsidy or equity however where the internal control system of the audited agencies is inadequate the commission may adopt such measures including temporary or special pre-audit as are necessary and appropriate to correct the deficiencies it shall keep the general accounts of the government and for such period as may be provided by law reserve the vouchers and other supporting papers pertaining thereto two the commission shall have exclusive authority subject to the limitations in this article to define the scope of its audit and examination establish the techniques and methods required therefore and promulgate accounting and auditing rules and regulations including those for the prevention and disallowance of irregular unnecessary excessive extravagant or unconscionable expenditures or uses of government funds and properties